Right now at 3.30, the federal civil case involving Miami City Commissioner Joe Corroyo continues. And today, another former staff member testifying against him. Local 10's Ian Margul joins us live from Miami with the latest. Ian. That staff member was his former secretary, and she said the commissioner coerced her to accuse two other former Corroyo staff members of sexual harassment. The only problem is those sexual harassment accusations, she says, were false. Stunning testimony continues in the federal civil trial of Miami Commissioner Joe Carroyo. Carroyo is being sued by Miami entrepreneurs Bill Fuller and Martin Pania, who allege the commissioner repeatedly abused his power by harassing them and hurting their companies, all because they supported his political opponent in 2017. On Wednesday, Carroyo's former secretary, Tanya Quintana, took the stand testifying in front of the jury that she was coerced by the commissioner and his wife, Marjorie, to falsely accuse other former Carroyo staff of sexual harassment, not once, but twice. The first was Steve Miro, who worked as a district liaison for Carroyo, and the other was Richie Blom, the former Doral police chief turned Carroyo's chief of staff. Quintana, who is related to Carroyo, said on both occasions, the commissioner and his wife manipulated her into claiming that Miro and Blom acted inappropriately toward her. On the stand, she said, quote, I was terrified. I was 20. It was my first real job. He's related to me and the family. So one, I didn't want to lose my job. And two, I didn't want to cause any problems with him that would move into my family matters. She also told jurors that the lies, quote, broke her and that she still can't believe she did it. Afterward, as they left court for the day, Fuller walked by the news cameras with this to say. It's a beautiful day in Miami. It is a beautiful day. No comment on the case. So Carroyo's attorneys did ask Quintana if she had lied under oath before. How could the jurors trust her today? And her response was, look, the first time I was worried about him. The second time I was trying to defend my family, protect my family. She says this time her family is already so fractured and broken up over all of this that she has nothing to lose and nothing to lie about and guaranteed she was telling the truth. There's not going to be court on Thursday or Friday. They are back on Monday morning. And first thing, Monday morning, Carroyo himself is expected to take the stand. Live in Miami, I'm Ian Margul, Local 10 News.